Good morning, Tanner here with Darrow Shirky for the Lincoln in Montpelier, Ohio. I'm right, just going to do a quick walk around of this avalanche for you. I always tell people not to freak out. I just try to point out everything that I see along the passenger side. I mean, it looks like there was at some point bubble rust that they did cover up. Obviously took care of their fender wells. Running boards along the side. Black, you can't see a scratch. Kind of minute, but you can see it right above the handle there. This is what I was talking about. Very, very bottom of the doors. You see a little bit right there. Once again, it is an O2. The door itself, very clean. Typically a good sign somebody took care of their vehicle. They do have the Chevrolet rubber floor mats. Leather is in good seat. That one shows a little bit more in terms of wear. Still pretty darn sturdy. Rubber floor mats right there. So we take a peek in the back, much of the same. Rubber floor mats in the back. Leather seats are quite clean as well. This is what I was talking about. Very, very, very bottom of the door. Once again, you don't see it unless that door is open, but it is there. The door itself quite clean. I mean, they really did a good job taking care of these fenders. Already have the bed open for you. They do have a mat in there, but we will lift up for you. And pretty darn clean underneath, to be frank with you. Tri-full tunnel cover up top. Everything you need for towing along the backside. And let's see if we can get through the grass and check underneath. At any point you can pause this video as well. Tailgate step, something nice they do with Chevy. I actually like Chevy's tailgate step way better than Ford's. Once again, fender well is incredibly clean. Driver's side looks pretty darn good in terms of no real scratches. Right there, very bottom of the door. I don't know what you were doing in 02, I've changed quite a bit. Doors themselves pretty darn clean. A little bit at the bottom right there. Look at the driver's seat. No rips, you can see the wear and tear. No real rips. And as we take a peek underneath the avalanche, it appears like they did a halfway decent job taking care of the avalanche, just from the surface, but who knows? But hey, this avalanche as well as myself, we'll be here Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, nine to seven, taking our last appointment at 5.30. Wednesday and Friday, 9 to 5.30, taking our last appointment at 4.30. And then Saturday, we're actually here 9 to 3. So if you could, give me a holler, 419-485-3181, and ask for Tanner. Appreciate you. Can't wait to speak with you soon.